Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Christy and if you haven't been here before, what the fuck? <laughs> so I haven't made a video in quite some time. As you can tell, um, there's some cosmetic differences with my appearance. I have dyed my hair. Um, I'm also not in the same background that I'm usually in. I'm in my car at a park right now, so there's that. The, the background's different. I'm different. Hey, what's up, 2021? Still the same me. So I figured I would give a little update on to what's going on in my life and why I haven't really been on YouTube as much or like creating content um, like I would prefer to be. So I've been going through some weird shit right now and I had to move out of the apartment that I was filming in, which is not a big deal. That's not even like why I have stopped filming. I mean, it's part of the reason, but it's not like why I have stopped filming YouTube videos. Um, I recently went through this like weird breakup and like I said, it was weird. So kind of over it whatever but um I was dealing with that and then I figured out I had to move so I've kind of just like really not really been focusing my energy into YouTube so which is whatever completely fine I took a little hiatus uh, I wasn't even really like that into YouTube <laughs> like for like far enough into YouTube really nobody watches me so if you're watching this what's up I'm going back to Block Island in April or May, I'm not really sure. I'll have the date or, yeah, the date soon. Um, but yeah, I kind of wanted to just like get on camera and like talk. I figured that this channel, for now at least, will be a vlog slash, you know, like a vlog channel or whatever until like more people start watching it. Cause I don't want to like, just like start making videos that I feel like nobody's gonna watch so I know that I like to watch vlogs so I'm just gonna be a vlogger right now New York sucks it has snowed like 8 million times so far I'm in upstate New York um it sucks here it's disgusting there's snow everywhere I'm currently filming at this little park because I don't like filming in my bedroom at my mom's house because it's just weird for me I don't I'm not really comfortable with that step yet so I'm kind of just like hey here we are <laughs> and also I've seen like eight old men walk by on their own on their own nobody even with them like why are you walking in winter on your own when you're an old man because you're gonna trip and you're gonna fall <sighs> and I don't want to be the one to rescue you so I kind of just like hopped on here to like I don't know post an update put content out there um, kind of not just like disappear and 86 myself off of the YouTube community because when shit first started happening in my life I kind of really wanted to just do that I was like oh forget this like fuck this I'm not I'm not creating content I don't want to do anything blah 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 but I realized that is not like the right mentality or like mindset to have for exactly what I'm going through and I mean like I'm not really going through like 2021 sucks so far but it's not like I was kind of expecting it, like, I don't know who the fuck would be like, oh yeah, 2021, or 2020 was terrible, and then be like, but this little, this midnight, this midnight's gonna change it all. This one, this one midnight is gonna just be like, oh, 2020's gone, it's 2021 now, there's no problems in my life. Yeah, so it didn't really happen like that, and I don't know anybody who really thought it was gonna happen like that, but... Newsflash, 2021 still sucks. There's been a whole bunch of crazy shit going on. This bitch put Gorilla Glue in her hair. I don't need to say anything else about that. <laughs> but like, I've been going through some health problems. Uh, a lot of people that I know have been going through health problems. So it's just been weird to like, want to pick up a camera and like, try to like, 
get it out in that sort of sense, especially with just like so much going on in the world and I don't know, it's just like the world is crazy right now, which is like an okay thing to say. I hate when people pretend like they know like everything that's going on and like what's going to happen and it's like no. You don't fucking know what's gonna happen. Honestly, there's like a lot of good music coming out right now. I know um, one of my favorite artists just dropped a full album and she got like number one on hip, hip hop on iTunes. I don't know if she's still number one. Um, her like, I don't know if her album's still number one on, in hip hop right now in iTunes, but her name's Nova Rockefeller and she's dating Tom McDonald or Tom McDonald's dating her. I shouldn't like, you know. The she's dating Tom McDonald. No, Tom McDonald's dating her. She's a badass bitch. So, anyway, she dropped a new album. It's fucking fantastic. Um, there's a whole bunch of new music out. I mean, like, if you can't tell, I really, like, listen to all music. Like, every single type of music. Besides, like, classic and that kind of shit. Like, I like... I don't like that. It's weird. Anyway... Drop some of the music that you guys like to listen to in the comments. I always like to, like, find new music. Like I just said, like, I fucking love everything. So drop some music or links or something that you like in the comments. And I will definitely check those out. I love, love, love. Like, that's, like, one of the only things I do is, like, listen to music. Especially because during this pandemic, haven't really been getting out much. I mean, like, my my town's a small town anyway, so, like, I don't really, like, have anywhere to go. I've been to a couple friends, friends' houses, um, but, like, not frequently, especially because my sister has, like, a newborn baby, and I don't really want to, like, go traveling around and, like, not know that, like, I get sick or something. I'm not, like, a person that gets sick very often or, like, has symptoms of sickness, like, a like let's say a cold or something, I'm not talking about like health problems like I talked about before, but like like an actual sickness, like a cold or something. I don't really like get sick that often like that. So, or like when I do, I don't really like realize that I have it. So I don't really wanna be like going around and then going to visit the baby and possibly getting her sick because that would be a very rude thing to do. So I've kind of just been like staying in, chilling. Um, I'm supposed to be going to Texas soon, which is actually pretty cool, which <laughs> completely against what I just said, but I have a friend there in some need of my assistance and I can't, I can't just leave my friend uh, stranded basically. So um, I'm going to Texas, driving back from Texas to New York. That's gonna be really fun. She she told me that she would pay for everything because I'm going to help her out or whatever. Um, she told me that she would pay for like the, in the entire trip, like blah, 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 blah. And she was like, oh yeah, and anything you wanna do. The first and only thing that I wanna do is get me some fucking Texas barbecue. That's all I want. If there's anybody, anybody in Texas watching this right now, I'm going to Granbury, Texas. I wanted to go to Snow's Barbecue, but then I looked it up and realized it was in Lexington, Texas. That made me really upset. Also, Snow's Barbecue is only open on Saturday, and that's actually a very depressing thing because apparently it's one of, like, the best in Texas, and I was really upset by that <laughs> because I am a chef, and I wanted to go to fucking Snow's Barbecue, but if anybody has any other suggestions that are, like, we're going like up through Dallas and then through Arkansas and Kentucky and Tennessee and stuff like that. So if anybody has any suggestions on places to like stop or go on the way through like Dallas and stuff like that, just uh, drop them down in the comments because that is the only thing I want to go to Texas for is the barbecue because as I previously mentioned, I am a chef and food gets me fat kid excited oh my god if you couldn't tell by the double chin that i am packing in all these videos i love food everything surrounding food food is delicious but i also should be not eating as much as i do 
<laughs> it's hard going to like I thought that I was going to gain so much more weight during culinary school than when I became like an actual like cook but it was like the complete opposite which is kind of weird like I gained so much more weight after culinary school and like being an actual cook than I ever did in culinary school which was weird because we ate like literally every single thing that we cooked in culinary school like almost every unless you didn't want to eat it obviously you could like take it home blah 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 but like now during my job it's just like tasting a lot of things and I just get fat from tasting shit which I don't mind I have to taste everything but like whatever yeah, so basically, I just wanted to get on here and kind of, like, let whoever the fuck does even, like, glance at my channel know that I am alive. My hair is purple and blue now. The blue actually faded out, which I'm pretty upset about. I, like, did the tips blue, but it's, like, uh, a little faded. I kind of want to just go, like... A little darker than the blue on my shirt to my whole hair but I also kind of just want to go teal again which I was teal if nobody knew when I started this channel I didn't have any color in my hair I literally I think my hair was like a pink color when I first started this channel um I like bleach bathed it and it like took so, like some of the color out and it like kind of turned like a baby babyish pink um, and then that's like after um, I went through some shit, I decided to dye my hair. So I did like purple up here. Here, let me take my beanie off. My hair's wet, so that's why it looks gross right now, but just showing you. So it's like purple on top, kinda. And then I did, I think the word's ombre. I'm stupid, I can't use words right now, but it also looks terrible on camera. And also, after I did it, a dumb bitch decided to go in and was like, oh yeah, I kind of want e-girl bangs. And then <laughs> I have my blonde coming in. I kind of just want to like either bleach bath the rest of this because I don't need to bleach it fully because my hair is blonde. It'll just, it comes out really easy, the color pigments. Um, I'm just going to like get the strip the color out of my hair as much as possible and then either go try to go back to blonde again or go to like a... A little bit darker than this blue kind of like a, a super blue like a superman blue kind of color um but that's all speculation i might just be a pussy and go back to blonde <laughs> i am doing i'm doing okay i'm doing well hope everybody out there is doing well um yeah basically it I need to add a video of me cracking a beer <laughs> to the end of this because that's like my opener each time so or like I should make that my opener each time but I just picked up the beer and I'm not cracking a beer at a park um no bueno so I'm gonna go home I'm gonna record the ending of this like the outro of me cracking a beer and I will see you next time, guys. Bye.